we're at Pier 40 in New York City. This pier is on the western side of Manhattan in the main branch of the Hudson River coming down from upstate New York. It's an incredibly rich area in uh, production of marine life. We're looking at the effects of light and shading on fish habitat. So obviously the fish have been here before people were here. They use this habitat, especially the shallow habitat. And that whole area has been modified now. There's bulkheads and there are these very high piers. Jenna's moving underneath the pier now in a very measured pace. There's a didson that's strapped underneath the kayak. The didson is a type of sonar. It stands for dual frequency identification sonar. And they'll be actually watching fish underwater. And they're gonna paddle slowly from fixed distance out all the way to the center of the pier, uh, paddling at a fixed rate. And they're gonna be talking into a microphone at the same time that records uh, in the same timestamp and keeps track of where they are because you don't have GPS under the pier. So we use the numbered pier pilings as reference points as we move down that gradient until we're at the very center of the pier and then we turn around and come back out and go to another spot. We'd like to be able to quantify the effect of light on the distribution of fish to we'll see how we might be able to interact with the environment a little bit more gracefully. So can we make the piers, for instance, narrower or higher or something like that. So there's a number of different steps in understanding what the whole impact comes down to that has to be broken down piece by piece and understood 